Good morning, everybody. I'm going to do an update on the old high tunnel and what's going on. As you can see right here, we have pulled out uh, this row of tomatoes over on the right. Over here was where we had uh, okra and one row of tomatoes. And uh, pulled them out. We're going to plant some greens here. So what we do now, instead of tilling, uh, we're broad forking. That's what this is. So we've already stuck it in the ground. So basically what happens is you put her in there and pull up. That's what happens. You get the down into the roots. And uh, this was really, really hard. So pardon me. Let's do it again. So you pull that up, put some compost in there. I think we've got some worm action going on. So that is what's called broad forking. And hit a little resistance here. So just have to keep going. Takes a little time, but really produces good results and doesn't uh, bring up all the weed seeds that you get when you rototill every time. So that's why we do it. Did this whole thing last year and it really made a difference. Lots of compost and broad forking. Okay, we are getting production up high. Of course, down low, it's pretty much done. Still got some few tomatoes clear down at the bottom. Well, you think it's at the bottom, but this thing's been laid over. So really, it's kind of medium, me in the medium, in the middle, medium middle. Uh, here's some tomatoes we picked yesterday. Didn't have a container for them. And uh, yeah, these, these tomatoes are getting big. Yep. Here's some that we pulled off the vines. As soon as they get uh, to start to get ripe, we're pulling them off now because we've got some uh, critter pressure and some splitting going on because uh, overwatered it a couple of days. Look at this. These guys are getting back to big slicer size. Gone clear up to the top. Look at that little guy. So, yeah, we're gonna have tomatoes here, unless something drastic like a blight comes in and wipes them all out, but we've got production going on. Look at here. So, yep. Over here are our uh, early girls, and we're having some issues here. We've got some uh, bugs or uh, fungus or both. We've got some powdery mildew going on over here. I'm going to show you what that looks like. It's nasty. So we've got over here and then you come up on this stuff. Looks like somebody put powdered sugar on it. That is powdery mildew. I already put a normal fungicide on it, trying to wipe it out. One that I use a lot called Serenade. Look at this. But we're gonna have to get uh, the copper fungicide out and hopefully that'll take care of it. Right now it's on about three plants, but you can see it's affecting the leaves down there or bugs and uh, some tomatoes there. Still going on, still fighting them here and there, but uh, we're gonna have tomatoes till it freezes, no doubt about it. Y'all be careful, be safe, we'll see you next time.